players drop to the knee. And away here goes Lehman with a chance for an early cross into the box all the way through and out the other side. Raise the ball forward here towards Lehman. And back out wide towards Mailing. Nice looking delivery again. Others in the lineup. Another positive looking attack here for Villa, and it's Lehman who's away. Lehman with an effort over the top of the crossbar. And has taken a deflection. Hoping for here. Carla Ward's side starting on the front foot, and Alicia Lehman has been right at the heart of things. Makes her way up into the penalty area to make a nuisance of herself here. Shins again inside the six yard box, and it has been turned in on the goal line. Big celebrations as the ball crosses the line. A devilish delivery, and just three minutes in, it's Aston Villa who take the lead. Scrapping to win the ball and does well to keep hold of it. Moves it back towards Mailing. Grown with Aston Villa this season. He was looking for the free kick there. Didn't get the decision from the referee. The back under pressure from Hales. Chance Probably. to deliver. Gets the cross in as well. Aston Villa looking for goal number two, and they might just grab it here. Although the flag is up on the far side, and it will be a free. Demi Allen shifts it wide, manages to find Mailing. Mailing with a chance with the challenge. Free kick, Aston Villa. Aston Villa do have another corner though from the same side from where they scored. Less than nil. three minutes in. But it's Aston Villa who are forcing the issue a bit more here and look the more likely to go on to score another goal for the away team. Good centre forward play by Hales for Aston Villa. Making a real nuisance of herself. Dick has been get the ball to Alicia Lehman as quickly as possible. Finds herself on the grounds here. And as she did against. He charged down by Flint. Aston Villa throwing on the far side. They have seen significant improvements. Players momentarily while Sophie Howard was offered the field. That would have been a cruel blow. Plenty of joy. Mailing onto Lehman. Lehman cuts away from Tierney. Looking for the give and go. Superb defending. Plumped up. Sent forward here by Howards. Looking for the run. A job well done so far for Aston Villa. It's mailing. And across comes Lehman. Does well. Too much in the way of problem at the back. They have been more than a match for everything. This for Leicester. Gemma Purfield is going to be the one to take this one. Needs an option. I don't think she realised that Petzelberger was right on her shoulder, but she manages to, just as Aston Villa was starting to go up through the gears. Plum to step to cross. Aston Villa so effective from set pieces in the first half. Leicester will know they have their work cut out here as Aston signalled for a corner. Again, it's Alicia Lehman with good work on the right-hand side. Now that Aston Villa have found a way for her to play, they really are starting to... The uh, injury just a moment ago was worse than we thought for Chloe Arthur. Arthur is removed. Marches away with the ball. Leicester can break here with Esme de Graaf. Anita Asante. A turn here, though, and off she goes. Been killed up. Good work by Howard. In the ball and the player is well won back by Aston Villa. Crossing opportunity. Lifted ball, which should be gathered and is by Demi Lamborn. And Leicester See displayed. Six. Leicester take the throw. And it's given away by Sigsworth. Off. Lifting the ball forwards. Lambourne should come to claim and does.
Anita Asante with a heavy Dice. touch can maintain this right up until the final whistle. This is normally the stage where you start to see mistakes where after such heavy running for 70 minutes, well, straight the... up into the penalty area. More questions to be answered here by the Aston Villa defence. Leicester sticking to the top. Constant eyes up towards the clock. 1-1 one, one the score here, nine minutes to go. Concede that, conceded the equalising goal, although there may be some question marks over the decision and whether or not there should have been Under a third feet. The delivery's good. Lehman there sets up the chance for Aston Villa, which is fired over the top. Football can be a cruel sport, and there may well be a winner. We have five minutes to find that out. Has support here in O'Brien. And O'Brien gets the cross into the front post, and Leicester get the chance in on goal, but it's straight at Hannah Hans. Maz Pacheco. Forwards, and luckily for Lambourne, her defenders stand firm. And it's cleared away for another Aston Villa. Thought about the pass to Macheco. Instead, instead sends it up towards Lehman. There's both coaches pacing up and down here. Sixworth finds the pass. Sends it wide here to Plumpter. Plumpter onto Pike. Runs into traffic. Aston Villa can clear. Boy, Halorka is back there. McManus challenge. That touch there off of Howard. Finds its way through fortuitously towards Lehman and Lehman sends in to surely give Aston Villa all three points here. Big celebrations for Aston Villa. Well, it is it's really, really harsh on Leicester. Well, they may well look back on missed chances Leicester in this second half, in particular the one for Natasha Flint. Can't imagine there will be too long left in the game now. It's turned in by a Leicester defender on the goal line. And Aston Villa, who'd clearly set out to start the game on the front foot, did just that. Leicester had very few chances in the first half. This for Sixworth, probably the best of those. It was Aston Villa who were the more dominant force in the opening 45.